Hello everyone, welcome to High School Mathematics channel. Today we are going to learn Class 6, Chapter 4, Integers, Exercise 4.2. See now example 3, arrange the following integers in ascending order. Minus 8, 0, minus 1, 3, minus 5, minus 20 and 12. See the solution now. First we have to take negative integers. Minus 20. Minus 8, minus 5, minus 1. In integers, smallest number will be greatest and greatest number will be smallest. As any order means arranging the numbers from smallest to biggest. So here minus 20 is less than minus 8, minus 8 is less than minus 5 and minus 5 is less than minus 1. Then after 0 we shall write. 0 is neither positive nor negative. Then after we have to arrange the positive numbers from small to big. Here 3 is the smallest positive integer. Then after 12. So this is the ascending order of the given integers. See example 4. Write the integers on either side of the given integers that is lesser or greater. See the first one minus 5. The integers on either side of minus 5 are minus 6 and minus 4. See the second integer is 0. The integers on either side of 0 are minus 1 and plus 1. Third integer is 3. See the third one. The integers on either side of 3 are plus 2 and plus 4. See now exercise 4.2. First question. Put appropriate symbol greater than or less than in the boxes given. See the first one minus 1 and 0. Negative numbers are always less than 0. Therefore minus 1 is less than 0. See the second one minus 3 and minus 7. Minus 3 is greater than minus 7. See the third one minus 10. And plus 10. Negative numbers are always less than positive numbers. Therefore, minus 10 is less than plus 10. See the second question now. Write the following integers in increasing and decreasing order. Increasing order means arranging the numbers in ascending order. That is from small to big numbers. Observe this number 9. So that we can arrange the numbers easily in increasing and decreasing order. Minus 7, 5 and minus 3. If we observe in this number line from left to right, first we will get minus 7. So write down minus 7. Then after we will get minus 3. Then we are having 5. So this is the increasing order. Decreasing order means arranging the numbers from big to small. So write this reverse order 5 minus 3 minus 7. This is the decreasing order. See the second question, minus 1, 3 and 0. If we observe this number line from left to right, first we will get minus 1, then after we will get 0, next we will get 3. So this is the increasing order. Next one decreasing order, that is arranging the numbers from big to small. So write these numbers in reverse order, 3, 0 and minus 1. See third sum now, 1, 3 and minus 6 we have to arrange in increasing order. If we observe on this number 9, minus 6 you will get first. Right on minus 6, then after 1, then after 3. So this is the increasing order. Now let us write decreasing order. That means arranging the numbers from big to small. So reverse order of this 3, 1 and minus 6. See fourth question, minus 5, minus 3, minus 1. If we observe on this number 9, first we will get minus 5, then after minus 3, then after minus 1. Now let us see the decreasing order. That is arranging the numbers from big to small. So right reverse of this minus 1, minus 3 and minus 5 is the decreasing order. See third question now, write true or false. See the first one. 0 is on the right side of minus 3. For all negative numbers, right side 0 will be present. Therefore, the given statement is true. See the second one. Minus 12 and plus 12 represent on the number line the same integer. 
minus 12 and plus 12 are different on the number line. So, the given statement is false. See third one. Every positive integer is greater than 0. Yes, all positive integers are greater than 0. So, write down true. Fourth one, minus 100 is greater than plus 100. Always negative integers are less than positive integers. So, the given statement is false. See, fourth question now. Find all integers which lie between the given two integers and represent them on the number line. See, the first one, minus 1 and plus 1. Integers between minus 1 and plus 1 is 0. So, mark the integer on the number line 0. See the second one, minus 5 and 0. Integers between minus 5 and 0 are minus 4, minus 3, minus 2 and minus 1. Let us represent these integers on the number line now. Minus 4, minus 3, minus 2 and minus 1. The integers between minus 5 and 0 are minus 4, minus 3, minus 2. And minus 1. Now let us see remaining sums also in this. See the third sum now. Minus 6 and minus 8. Integers between minus 6 and minus 8 is minus 7. Now let us represent this on the number line. Minus 7. See the fourth question. 0 and minus 3. Integers between 0 and minus 3 are minus 2. Minus 1. So write down those numbers. Minus 2 and minus 1. See the fifth sum now. The temperature recorded in Shimla is minus 4 degrees Celsius. And in Kafri is minus 6 degrees Celsius on the same day. Which place is colder on the day? Why? Let us see the solution now. The lowest temperature recorded at Kafri. That is minus 6 degrees Celsius. Which place is colder on the day? Kafri is colder than Shimla on the day. Why? Because minus 6 degrees Celsius is less than minus 4 degrees Celsius. So, Kafri is the lowest temperature and it is colder than Shimla. Today we have seen chapter 4 integers exercise 4.2 with example sums. Hope you all like this video. If you like this video, please like, share to your friends and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.